Good on your first tram be a goal and an important one as well. Yeah, obviously happy to get on the score sheet. Um, important goal. We had uh, plenty of time after to, you know, we thought we were going to go on and win the game. Um, we applied pressure. We done much better performance in the second half, I think. Um, but we just couldn't get that second one. But like we've said in there, um, you know, we might look on that point and it'd be an important one. You know, they they played well today, Harrogate. They put us under a lot of pressure, especially first half. Um, and and yeah, you know, we look at it as a positive positive point in the end. They've had a couple of home wins this week, so obviously coming in, you know, on a, a good run of form as far as they're concerned. And uh, Big Armstrong up front, he's a tricky customer, isn't he? Yeah, we knew what their strengths were going to be. We, um, you know, we prepared exactly how we should have done. Um, you know, we didn't get off the first half um, as well as we liked to have. Um, the first half wasn't as good from our point of view, but um, like I said, the reaction from the second half we thought was fantastic. And, um, you know, we were obviously hoping to go on and win the game. But, um, you know, the run continues. You know, we don't have to win. Well, we want to win every single game but like I said we look at this away performance as a good point taken um, and now on to three home games yeah I mean the first half just didn't really threaten them very often you didn't get the ball wide and, and, and play to your strengths did you but the second half obviously you did yeah we spoke about that at half time I think we were playing a little bit too narrow as a team um, you know everyone involved in that and we weren't getting the ball in our in our wide areas which is our strengths and um, we had a fantastic opportunity with Nev and it was a it was an unbelievable block from their player you know so um, fair play to him they managed to, to get a goal which uh, was a bit disappointing you know we wanted to keep that clean sheet run going um, but you know it's an opportunity to start up another one now I'm sure with Danel last week when he scored against Crew. you know you're going to have a, a little competition between you and <laughs> about scoring goals this season uh, have, you, have you got any targets yet? <laughs> no obviously that, that that's good competition you know healthy competition um, we want to get everyone on the score sheet we want everyone contributing we can't just leave it to the strikers to score every week um, we need goals coming in from everywhere so um, no look I'm happy to help the team out today um, um, and obviously get my first goal and hopefully many more. A lot of variation with the set pieces I thought in the second half and you're causing a lot of problems didn't you? You could have had more than that goal that you scored. Yeah, you know, we're, we're, good, we're a good threat from set pieces. We got on the end of a lot. Um, and like I said, we, we put the pressure on them. We, we got ourselves into those situations and, you know, one just didn't come off for us. Um, another day, another few might go in the net, but um, no, it, was, it was a positive second half, so we're happy with that. And obviously pressing for the victory, but it took a, a really good clearance by Leo Conrad <coughs> at the end, isn't it? When he, he, he got back and cleared that cross that looks like it was going to be a tip. Yeah, sometimes that happens. Um, look, we were obviously pressing for the for the goal. I think I found I think I was still up as well. So mm. Lee found himself in my position and um, and made a brilliant clearance. Um, it's a team effort at the end of the day. It's the same when we were going on clean sh that clean sheet run. You know, it's not just the back four. It's not just me and D. It's the whole team. So um, you know, it was a real team effort today. And just how important are these three home games now? I mean, you know, obviously, you know, Rochdale as well. You know, they've had a struggling start to the season themselves. But important to win on Tuesday and then take advantage of the three in a row. Yeah. Of course, look, we know Rochdale have had a, have a, had a tough start, but um, so did Harrogate, and you know they performed today. So every game is going to be difficult for us. Um, hopefully, we can capitalise now on those three home games. I think we've been fantastic at home in, in general. So, um, like I said, if we can make this point worth it now, if we, we take four points at home, then um, you know it'd be brilliant. Uh, and a lot of travelling recently as well, so it must be great from a, from a training perspective and having a bit of rest time to, to not be travelling up and down the country quite so much. Yeah, of course, um, we've had a few few long away trips now, but. Um, um, three home games on the trot. Um, you know they're coming thick and fast though Saturday, Tuesday. So um, make sure we prepare right back in Monday. Um, you know make sure we're ready for that game. And the Friday night last week, obviously, you know the great Prenton Park atmosphere under the lights. So you can have that Tuesday night as well. You know, so so I mean the fans here today as well. I mean, you, you great great support for you, Jordan. Yeah, fantastic. Um, they come out in their numbers today. We could you know really hear them throughout the game. Uh, my first experience on a Friday night at Prenton on, on on last Friday, and I thought it was unbelievable. Um, so yeah, if we can get that same atmosphere, same crowd on Tuesday, it'd be it'd be it'd be brilliant for us. And um, you know, it really helps the team spur us on. You know, especially when it's difficult, tough periods of the game. Um, it really does help. And a celebration in front of the fans as well today. Did you have one plan knowing when your first goal was going in? <laughs> No, nah, I, prob I probably should have ran and got the ball and tried to, you know, start the game a little bit quicker. But um, now nah, Moshe's got the better of me. Um, that was obviously a great feeling. So hopefully, like I said, many more. And it was in the goal in front of our fans as well. So that was brilliant. Well